I guess there's more. I've been more like aware and more careful with where I go and what I do. Um, more responsibilities, more worries. Um, I'm matured a little bit. So when COVID started, we were like, it's not a big deal until we heard the news and how many people were getting sick and what it does. And around June, so for the past like three years, I've had like, if you hit my shoulder, uh, it will hurt a lot. And by and around June, it started to swell up and my mom started to notice, but she didn't want to go to the doctor because of COVID and she didn't want to risk it until she saw it was getting real bad. And then we did like test after test for like two weeks until they found out it was a tumor in my right shoulder, under my shoulder blade. And it was um, a cancerous tumor. So then they started to ha have chemotherapies. The first one, it went well. And after that, it started to get a little bit worse because I kept getting nauseated, mm -hmm. sick. Um, around December, we got COVID. Both of you? Uh, yeah, me, my mom, and my brother. And we, my mom was was the one who felt more sick. And because I was going through chemotherapy, even though I didn't feel anything at the time, um, we still did the test. Me, my mom, and my brother, we all got positive. And then we quarantined for two weeks. Um, thank God, me and my brother didn't get as sick as my mom did. Um, and January, when I, uh, I'm at church. Uh, they did an election for, um, presidents for teens, preteens, and they elected me. And then after that, more responsibilities came up. I mean, so far it's been good. Mm -hmm. um, my chemos, I've been dealing better with it. I go to animal therapies mm -hmm. on Saturdays and yeah. Well, last year when COVID started, at the end, at the, end of, like, the second semester it was like online. Um, I hated it. <laughs> I couldn't do any work. I couldn't learn like that. And then when school started again, I felt now it was online. I barely, I could barely do my work. Uh, I wasn't turning as as much work as I could have until I told my doctor about it, and she said, "You you can ask for a teacher to come to my house." I asked for it, and then I got my homebound teacher, mm -hmm. and I've been catching up to, with with my work for around. A semester already so they give the choice to uh, go to school like two days a week or be online my mom chose to be online because of she she asked the doctor what she should do she's and the doctor said right now they don't know they, the doctor told her that right now they didn't know if chemotherapy makes it make me make, makes me a bigger chance of getting COVID so then um, we started it online um, Ever since um, I started to get chemotherapy, my mom stopped working because of me. And around a month ago, a doctor that worked at the hospital that took care of my little brother when he had cancer, when he was little, um, asked if she, she used to work at a, work at a cleaning company. Mm -hmm. And then she said if she could clean her house. And then that's what we've been doing like twice a week. Mm -hmm. No every two weeks i mean and i go help her with that